Hello fellow Doomslayers, today in this video I will show you my side project for uh, Brutal Doom 64 and this project is some weapons from Complex Doom ported into Brutal Doom 64. So what weapons are we talking about? Uh, the regular assault rifle, upgraded assault rifle and automatic shotgun. So what about the rifle? First of all, sprites is updated. I never, bo I never bothered to update uh, this uh, ugly hand, but you know, just two, two, li literally two weapons have this ugly hand, so I was like too lazy to update this hand, but whatever. So what about this weapon? First of all, it has this new cool sprite. Uh, the weapon itself is slightly improved. It has better reload animations. And this is replacement of the regular rifle. What about upgraded rifle? There it is. Uh, first of all, when you pick it up and uh, get it on your hands, your previous version of your rifle is gone, so you don't have it anymore. So what about it? First of all, it has uh, increased clip, increased by 10 bullets, and of course, you can shoot grenades from this rifle. Like this. Isn't that cool? I think this, this is pretty badass. Later I will show you these weapons in action. And the last weapon is automatic shotgun, also from Complex Doom. Pretty cool, huh? Now, let's see what inside of the VAT and how to get it to work. Well, inside of it is sprites for these weapons. So you have this rifle with grenade launcher and rifle without it. Both versions. And the outer shotgun as well. You have sounds for this weapons here. Sound info. Where I listed all the sounds and their options. We, get, we have K configurations and the I added weapons here and here. As you can see, uh, 64 rifle tactical is replaced by default. And yeah, this all made for tactical uh, player because come on, who the fuck plays classic? Uh, if I wanted to play classic, I wouldn't play brutal Doom. If I wanted to see the original 64 Doom, I would just Good original 64 Doom, not classic, so it all made for tactical, I forgot to mention it uh, in the beginning of this video, whatever. We have uh, the code for this weapon, the spawner for this weapon, and the ATSAS script, which is here, it's script number 755, to shoot grenades. So, what else do we have here? The spawner for this weapon. Uh, you can change it however you want, I, uh, I don't give a shit, so do whatever you want with this. It's, uh, it's legal, I guess. So, uh, Super Shotgun have 65% to be spawned as the regular Super Shotgun, 15% to be spawned as uh, this new tactical rifle, and 20% to be spawned as our Shotgun. Uh, and spawners for the lesser cool weapons like Shotgun. The uh, 97% to be spawned as the regular shotgun, 3% that uh, the regular shotgun uh, that you found on the map will be spawned as automatic shotgun. Rocket launcher, 5% that it will spawn instead of rocket launcher, this new tactical rifle uh, with grenade launcher. And chain gun uh, as well, 5% that it will be tactical new rifle and 95% uh, that it will be chain gun. Let me show you how it spawns on the map. So, all the time I will be starting the map like this, so it will have different weapons. What do we have here? 4 regular shotguns, 4 super shotguns, 4 chain guns, and 4 rocket launchers. Now let's see what are, what are the odds that uh, my new weapons will be spawned here. No new weapons, uh, 2 of the super shotguns replaced with our shotguns. No chain guns re replaced, no rocket launcher replaced. I think my chances is pretty reasonable, but if you want to increase chance of spawning, just go ahead and edit the decorate. 
no regular shotguns replaced. Two of the super shotguns replaces one of the shotgun and one tactical rifle. By the way, when you have rockets, it will automatically reload. And one of the rocket launchers is replaced with new tactical rifle. Pretty cool, huh? What else do I have here? The super shotguns. These are not, these are not replaced. Mm -hmm. One of chain guns replaced. So this is uh, pretty much it. So this is how replacement works. As you can see now, no weapons was, was replaced. One automatic shotgun and one tactical rifle. I guess it's pretty reasonable chances. But as, just as I said, if you want you can just spawn it right away or increase chances of spawning it. If you want to increase chance of spawning it, just uh, make these numbers uh, bigger and these numbers lower. So how do we make it work? I don't know which Doom Loader you use. I personally use Internet Doom Explorer like 10 years I use it, so I just got used to it even though it's old as fuck. So, you just add this pivot, the last, S is the last one, so it goes after the game. The game is uh, the main a Brutal Doom 64 game, it has all the default weapons. And you add this what as the last one, and you will have this new fancy weapons. So, I guess let's see it in action. Alright, let's do it. This is it, I guess. So, I hope you liked my new chat, and uh, don't expect me to make more, because those days when I was playing Doom all day long and modding and making new weapons is gone a long time ago. So, it's just fun side project, so I just made it to, to make you understand how cool it is, I guess, I don't know. This is it. Bye-bye!